How's it going? And welcome back. We're having a new tech time today. It's an extra special tech time because we have a guest. Hi there. This tech time's specifically about something that I bought for Victoria. She, with her new company, wanted to have a footprint in the YouTube world. So they're starting to create their own videos. But she didn't really want to carry a camera around and stuff like that. So we thought we would try something new. Not new on the market, but new for us. And that, for me, for sure. That is the DJI Osmo Mobile 6. Now, I'm a sort of a DJI customer. I've got a DJI drone, and I use, as I'm recording right here, my Osmo Pockets. Well, we thought maybe she could record stuff on her phone and have the Osmo Mobile 6 here to accompany her so she can get some pretty professional shots with nice, smooth textures and you know, no shakiness and all that. So... We wanted to unbox it up here at my workbench. Then we can take it downstairs where we have better light and we're going to play with it. Excited. All right, so let's get it open. Uh, so I, maybe that's the instructions. Oh, okay. So if this, this is probably the instructions. Oh, and a nice, Ooh, nice carrying I bag. I like that. Has nice. he sleep? And we have a USB charger. Now, this takes a USB-C cable. So if you have any of those lying around, they should be perfectly fine for this. And a quick start guide. All right. Well, let's see what the uh, stuff looks like. Well, first of all, we have a tripod. Oh, I love that. That's really nice. Oh, that's really slick. Yeah. Nice. And I believe this is... The uh, bracket for the phone. Now, I think it's magnetic, so you can put this on and pop your phone on and off. Oh, the... I love that. Yeah, so. All the things that will help me not drop things. Yeah. All those things are welcome. All right. And we have the device itself. It's really slick looking. Yeah, my understanding is all you have to do is actually flip it open, flip it up here, and it'll turn on. So let's try that. Okay, so look, right here. Right here. There's a locking mechanism. Oh, okay. So if you have it over like that, it's locked. So you actually have to flip this around to unlock it. And then okay. you just flip it up. And it's ready to start using. Nice. Now we have some controls here. The quick start guide sort of tells us what they are. We don't know what the red thing means. Maybe it means the phone's not attached. We don't know what the power, or that's clearly, yeah. clearly the charge. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so you want to hold this for a second? Yeah. Hold it right there. All right, so this right here controls the gimbal up, down, right, left. That is record and mm -hmm. stop. I think that button might be the zoom. Yeah, that feels like the zoom. And then I think this mode button, this M right here, this will take you from horizontal to vertical filming and also from filming forward to filming back in towards you. Oh. So we're going to explore all that stuff. Let's take this downstairs where we have good light. One of the things, first of all, is you have to install the DJI app on your phone. So we're going to do that as we're heading downstairs and we'll be all ready to go when we get down there. All right. All right, so the first thing we did was we clicked on the QR code on the box and it brought us to the DJI start page for the uh, Osmo 6. Now it's got several videos here, unboxing, unfolding, whatever, but it gets down to the DJI MIMO app. That's the app that we're gonna install here right now. It, then it controls the buttons, or, or then it goes over uh, the buttons and the indicator lights and all that. So we're going to first install DJI MIMO and move on from there. All right, now we've installed the MIMO app. Now that app comes directly from DJI. It is not in the Android or Apple store. Uh, I don't know why they've never got it uh, certified for that. You download it directly from them. And of course, then you get all sort of alarms about installing it uh, as far as it's untrusted, et cetera, et cetera. And it may very well be, uh, but uh, that's what we have to use for these tools. So now I, 
when I'm not up at my desktop, so I can't connect the phone to actually record the screen. So I'm going to use my GoPro and hand record some things. Look at that. So this is what the MIMO app looks like right out of the box. Now they want you to connect the device. Um, I suspect this probably connects via Bluetooth. So we're going to make sure that the handle is powered up and we're going to make an attempt to connect. So it says, welcome to Osmo Mobile 6. Attach mobile device to gimbal properly. Learn how to use Osmo Mobile 6 in a few easy steps. Get started. Okay, let's. It wants us to connect the device. So we do that using. I'm all excited about this. Using this magnetic bracket, which we're going to put on Victoria's phone. It just wraps right around, nice and easy. Is it magnetic? That part is not. This is. Oh, nice looks a little like a superhero sort of belt buckle thing. And it connected, snapped on pretty hard. Yeah, nice. Uh, but the screen's upside down. <laughs> All right, fumbling around a little bit, we learned a few things about it. <laughs> we learned that on the back, the, the magnetic thing has to be perfectly aligned. It, there is a, a notch right here. See it? that needs to be aligned within the, the seating. And it clicks right in, and that's a really strong magnet, by the nice. way. We also learned there's a trigger button right here. And to recenter, you pull the trigger twice. <laughs> okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn this over to Victoria and let her play with the buttons for a little bit. <laughs> and get familiar with her new her new uh device and i'm going to film her while she does it oh, oh okay you're gonna to have to give me some prompts i will that's okay. that's part of the part of the deal you now you said to i do this is this what i do just to kind of get it to reset uh no double trigger oh, okay don't tell me there we go so now if i want it to track me oh it's not letting me do it Wait, oh, okay, so if I did, okay. You should have a box around you. Do you have a, yeah, see a green box? Yeah, oh, okay. oh, I see, yeah, so. If you want to go from from vertical to horizontal, what do you do? Uh, well, first I have to stop filming it, right? Yeah, I don't think it's recording. Okay, so then I, that, and then don't, don't tell me. I do. I need a reminder. Yes, do tell me. I the, do something twice or once. The or... the bottom right control button. Do it twice. This one. Yes. I did it. I did it. Okay. Now, one click of that. Uh huh. Flips the camera. <gasps> Super cool. Okay. Click it again. It's back to you. Yep. All right. Now two clicks. Very cool. So this is a lot of stuff. This button right there is going to do a lot yes. of stuff. Okay. Now to record, you press the red button and you're recording. Yep. Oh, good. Okay. And if we wanted to flip um, to portrait, we would have to stop and then flip. Correct. Well, try it. See what oh. happens. Because before it gave us an error. So let's see. Let's I'm try to go. Twice. Let's try to go to portrait. Double click. Okay. Oh. Okay. So you did not have to do that. And it you didn't might have. You, you might have had to do that through the the control panel panel, but not the handle. Okay. Let's do. Now, um, oh, go ahead. Yeah. Um, now you can control depending on what mode it's in. You can control the attitude of the phone by the by the joystick, which is right there. Yeah. See. All right. See how you can control that and move it around. Nice. Nice. And you can do that while it's recording as well. One of the things we didn't explore, I would like to try this. Yeah. This is the zoom. The zoom. Okay. See, you can do. So theoretically, you should be holding it in your right hand, and you can mm -hmm. you can thumb that with your. Okay. Now push it one time. Oh, push it. Uh huh. And that allows you to. 
Current camera does not support manual focus. Okay. That's what it said. Okay. So what we learned from that is with your camera, you can only do the zoom. You can't do, you can't do the focus. So, but yeah. So if you had that flipped around. A beautiful hair. You had a lovely hair. Shout out to my hairstylist. All right. Now what we want to do is we want to attach the tripod to the bottom and let her play with it, with that a little bit. Hey, I'm leaning over here. I'm leaning over here. <laughs> So we have it on its tripod in action cam mode, and it's tracking her pretty well. I want to see, can, can I do it this way so we can see, guess who we're going to see if we do this? Oh, wait, don't tell me, I'm going to do this. Oh, but we want to, oh, oh, scene stealer. Okay, you could be recording, you press record. The, you could do that one or the red button on the handle. Beautiful girl. Such a good scene stealer. Such a good scene stealer. And so now I think it's notable, uh, as is the case with most things, the resolution's not as great because I'm like 6.1 right. times. Yeah. But let me just go back for for kicks. I feel like around like it's pretty decent up to like three and a half, even. Huh? Oh. That's right. So I'm going to stop recording. Okay. okay. And then in the on the mode button on the bottom right, you can mm -hmm. you could single click. Flips it back around to you. Oh, here I am. Tracks right on you. Mm -hmm. And now you can record your your work video. Okay. So I could be like uh bloody bloody blah, blah working 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 and blah blah. But over here, a bloody blah, blah, and bring it back here for a bloody blah, blah. That's good. Yeah, you like it? I do. I love it. Okay, so. I'm turning it off now. Yep. So you have your new Osmo Mobile. What do you think? I think it's pretty awesome, and I think that it's, you have all the fancy stuff, and that's fantastic. I need something not as fancy as you have. So this is gonna be, this is plenty fancy for me. And I would say for a vast majority of people who wanna either do some YouTube stuff or get some video for whatever reasons. All right, there we have it. That is this month's, is that how we're doing it now? Uh, <laughs> Tech Time video, doing the Osmo Mobile 6. Seems like a pretty cool device. It seems like it's absolutely uh, suits the suits the need for Victoria for her to do some recording of her own content for her for her company. And uh, on that note, we're going to wrap this up and we will see you next time. Bye. Thanks as always for stopping by.